The choice of visiting the Central African Republic by Pope Francis was a difficult one. But the most symbolic, especially on his last day Monday, when he visited the Grand Mosque of Kudoku in Bangui, meeting with the city's Muslim community. His message was crystal clear given the violence that has rocked the country pitting the largely Muslim Seleka forces against the anti-Balaka forces who are Christian since the year 2013. In a carefully worded speech, Pope Francis said, We are well aware that the recent events and acts of violence which have shaken your country were not grounded in properly religious motives. Those who claim to believe in God must also be men and women of peace. Christians, Muslims, and members of the traditional religions have lived together in peace for many years. Together, they must say no to hatred, no to revenge, and no to violence, particularly that violence which is perpetrated in the name of a religion or of God himself. God is peace. God salam. Recalling the upcoming national consultations, the Holy Father told the faithfuls, you cannot fail to express hope that the forthcoming national consultations will provide the country with leaders capable of bringing Central Africans together, thus becoming symbols of national unity rather than merely representatives of one or another faction. I strongly urge you to make your country a welcoming home for all its children, regardless of their ethnic origin, political affiliation or religious confession. The pontiff later celebrated Mass at Bangi's Bartholomew Boganda Stadium that was attended by thousands of the faithful before he flew back to the Vatican, ending a visit that hopefully will bring peace to the war-ravaged nation and sow love where there was hatred. Alex Kubasu, Monday Special.